Taiwan boasts a robust and dynamic financial sector. It plays a pivotal role in the island's economic prosperity. The financial industry attracts significant foreign investment. Taiwan's stock market reflects the performance of its leading companies. The Taiwan Stock Exchange is among the largest in Asia. Taiwan's financial sector is constantly evolving. The government promotes innovation and attracts foreign investment. Taiwan's financial sector is well positioned for continued growth. Taiwan's financial regulations are designed to ensure stability and protect investors. The rules cover a wide range of areas, including banking, insurance, securities, and futures. These regulations set out requirements for capital adequacy, risk management, and corporate governance. They are also designed to prevent money laundering and terrorist financing. One of the key objectives of Taiwan's financial regulations is to maintain financial stability, achieved through prudential requirements. These requirements ensure that financial institutions are well capitalized and have adequate risk management systems in place. The regulations also aim to protect investors by promoting transparency and fair dealing. Taiwan's financial regulations are constantly evolving, amended to reflect changes in the global financial landscape. The FSC consults with industry stakeholders to ensure that the regulations are practical and effective. The FSC also conducts regular inspections of financial institutions to ensure compliance with the regulations. What do you think about the current financial rules in Taiwan? While Taiwan's financial rules are designed to ensure stability, they have been criticized. Some local banks and insurers argue that the regulations are overly burdensome, stifling innovation, and hampering their competitiveness. They claim that the rules are too rigid and inflexible making it difficult for them to respond to changing market conditions. One of the main criticisms is the stringent capital adequacy requirements. Local banks and insurers contend that these requirements are too high, limiting their ability to lend and invest, which in turn hinders economic growth. They also point to the complex approval processes for new products and services. These processes are time-consuming and costly, putting us at a disadvantage compared to our foreign counterparts. We've called for a review of the regulations to streamline them and make them more business-friendly. Key criticisms include overly burdensome regulations, stringent capital adequacy requirements, and complex approval processes, which industry leaders believe hinder innovation and competitiveness. Do you agree with these criticisms? The Financial Supervisory Commission, or FSC, has acknowledged the concerns raised by local banks and insurers. The FSC has pledged to review and amend the regulations to ensure they are conducive to innovation and growth while maintaining financial stability. The FSC has indicated that it is open to feedback from industry stakeholders and has stressed that any amendments to the regulations will be made with careful consideration. They will prioritize maintaining financial stability and protecting investors. The FSC has also emphasized the importance of international cooperation to combat cross-border financial crime. The FSC's response to the criticisms has been met with cautious optimism by industry players. We hope that the FSC will follow through on its pledge to make the regulations more business friendly. The FSC's commitment to reviewing the regulations is a positive step, signaling a willingness to create a more conducive environment for the financial sector to thrive. The FSC's pledge for reform is an encouraging sign. It suggests that the government is committed to supporting the continued growth and development of Taiwan's financial industry. How do you think these changes will impact investors? Section 5. Streamlining Investment Potential Rule Amendments The FSC is considering a number of amendments to Taiwan's financial rules. These amendments aim to streamline regulations and enhance the competitiveness of local financial institutions. One proposed change is to relax the investment rules for insurance companies. This would give insurers greater flexibility in managing their portfolios. It could potentially lead to higher returns for policyholders. The FSC is also looking at ways to encourage more fintech investment. This could involve creating a more supportive regulatory environment for startups. It could also involve promoting innovation in areas such as blockchain and artificial intelligence. Another area of focus is on improving access to finance for small and medium-sized enterprises, or SMEs. SMEs are the backbone of Taiwan's economy. The FSC is exploring ways to make it easier for them to obtain funding. This could involve developing new financial products. It could also involve reducing the regulatory burden on lenders. 
Section 6, Overseas Investment Rules, Loosening the Reins. One significant area of potential reform is the easing of overseas investment rules. Currently, Taiwanese individuals and companies face restrictions on the amount of money they can invest abroad. These restrictions, designed to maintain financial stability within Taiwan, have been criticized for limiting growth opportunities. The FSC is considering raising the investment ceiling for overseas investments. This would allow Taiwanese investors to diversify their portfolios more effectively. It would also provide them with access to a wider range of investment opportunities. The move is seen as particularly beneficial to Taiwanese insurers. They are eager to invest in higher yielding assets abroad. The easing of overseas investment rules is expected to make Taiwan a more attractive destination for foreign investors. It signals a commitment to opening up the economy and promoting cross-border capital flows. However, the FSC has emphasized that any changes to the rules will be implemented gradually. This approach is designed to mitigate potential risks and ensure financial stability. Section 7. Insurance Sector Reforms – A New Era of Flexibility The insurance sector in Taiwan is poised for significant changes. The FSC is considering relaxing regulations. These changes are intended to give insurers more flexibility. One proposed change is to allow insurers to invest more in overseas markets. This would give them access to a wider range of opportunities. It could lead to higher returns for policyholders. The FSC is also looking at ways to streamline the product approval process. This would allow insurers to bring new products to market more quickly. They would be able to respond more effectively to changing customer needs. The FSC emphasizes that changes will be implemented carefully to ensure stability. The potential rule amendments being considered by the FSC have the potential to significantly impact investors. Relaxing investment rules could lead to increased investment opportunities and potentially higher returns. This is particularly true for investors in the insurance sector. They may benefit from insurers' ability to invest more freely in overseas markets. The easing of overseas investment rules could also benefit Taiwanese investors. They will have more options to diversify their portfolios internationally. This could lead to a more balanced and potentially less volatile investment landscape. However, it's important to note that any changes to financial regulations carry inherent risks. Relaxing regulations could potentially lead to increased volatility in the market. It could also increase the risk of financial instability. Investors should closely monitor the FSC's actions. They should carefully consider the potential impact of any rule changes on their investment strategies. As Taiwan navigates the complexities of financial rule easing, your insights are invaluable. We encourage you to share your thoughts on the potential impact of these changes. Do you believe that easing regulations will unlock growth and attract foreign investment? Or do you think it could compromise financial stability and investor protection? Your perspectives will enrich the conversation and contribute to a more comprehensive understanding of this evolving landscape. Share your thoughts in the comments section below. Engage in a meaningful dialogue with fellow viewers. Your voices matter in shaping the future of Taiwan's financial sector. We value your insights and invite you to participate in our Investor Confidence Survey. Your responses will provide valuable data on how these potential changes are perceived by investors. The survey is short and anonymous. It consists of just one key question. On a scale of 1 to 5, with 1 being not at all confident and 5 being extremely confident, how confident are you in the future of Taiwan's financial sector in light of the proposed rule changes? Click the link below to participate in the survey. Your participation will contribute to a better understanding of investor sentiment. This information can help inform future policy decisions. Taiwan stands at a critical juncture in its financial journey. Balancing the need for enhanced competitiveness with the imperative of financial stability is no small feat. The potential rule amendments, if implemented effectively, hold the promise of unlocking growth. They could attract foreign investment and bolster Taiwan's position as a key financial hub in Asia. However, it is crucial that these changes are introduced gradually and with careful consideration of potential risks. The FSC's commitment to transparency and stakeholder engagement will be paramount in ensuring a smooth transition. As Taiwan's financial sector evolves, staying informed and engaged is crucial. 
By participating in the conversation and sharing your insights, you can contribute to shaping a more vibrant and resilient financial future for Taiwan.